We recently took our family on an incredible RV camping trip to Pagosa Springs, Colorado. We drove through Pagosa Springs two summers ago when we were returning from visiting Mesa Verde National Park. We knew we had to come back to visit, and we stayed at the last resort on the river for four days and three nights, and we had an unforgettable adventure. Our journey began as we arrived at the last resort on the river campground nestled 10 miles south of Pagosa Springs. The campground offers stunning views of the Rio Blanco River surrounded by towering trees and breathtaking mountain scenery. The campground had zero cell phone coverage, so keep that in mind if you're planning to visit. It was the perfect spot for our family adventure. So we just got to our campground in Pagosa Springs. Uh, we're staying about 10 miles south on Highway 84. It's a really awesome campground called Last Resort on the River. A real small family-run campground. It's super great, but you can see, got our, got our rig all set up. Got it all set up over there. We're just hanging out and we're waiting to go on adventures tomorrow. Riff, riff rap, hey, Riff Rap Brewing Company, what'd you guys think? Um, good. Yeah, your view of the river. Kind of literally bad. right on the river. Uh, yummy. Good food, good food, good beer, yeah. good mimosa. Good drink menu. All right. right, let's head to the hot springs. Woo! Sure, where are we walking to? To go to Springs, to hot springs. So excited. <laughs> Are you guys excited? Yeah. 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 One of the highlights of our trip was visiting the famous Pagosa Hot Springs Resort. We spent a relaxing day soaking in the warm, natural, mineral waters surrounded by the tranquility of the San Juan River. It was pure bliss, and we felt all of our worries melt away. Due to the San Juan River being so high, five or six of the pools were flooded by the river. This was not a problem, and we always found room in the different healing pools. The next day we set out to explore the magnificent trails and natural wonders of Pagosa Springs. The first hike took us to the Pedro River Trail that led us to a breathtaking view of the snow-capped mountains. This trail had us two different trails. The first trail is hiking the Pedro River. The second trail took us up the mountain where we found ice fissures about a mile from the trailhead. 
This hike also led us to a series of cliffs that led to breathtaking views of the San Juan National Forest and the Rio Grande National Forest. After we finished this hike, we loaded up the truck to find Pedro Falls. Meat on your mind, you're looking a little unhealthy. All right, we just drove eight miles on a single lane dirt road, and we are going to hike. Piedra Falls, I believe that's how it's said. Don't quote me, I pronounce everything wrong and correctly. So, uh, it's about a mile hike, 100 feet of climbing. And come on with us as we go hike this. The hike to Piedra Falls is 0.9 miles according to our GPS. The trail is well groomed and is rated easy. The trail has two stream crossings. The first stream crossing had perfectly placed rocks so our feet didn't get wet. The second crossing has a nicely built bridge. Towards the waterfall, the trail gets narrow. This is only a challenge when the trails get crowded. The trail can get muddy and wet at times so make sure you bring proper shoes. So we made it to the falls. See it behind us. There we go. We can totally you can see the falls behind us. It 
is breathtaking. So, um, and you can get up real close to it. Yeah, so <laughs> it's, re it's real loud here. So river and waterfall is really high because the snow melt, but it is just incredible. All right, man, we've been here for a while. Let's go ahead and head back. Okay. As our time in Pagosa Springs came to an end, we reflect on the memories we created as a family, from relaxing in the hot springs to hiking the stunning waterfalls and experiencing the wonders of the ice fissures. This trip was truly a dream come true. We'll cherish these moments forever. Until next time, happy adventures. Layla, what's your favorite thing about hiking? Kimball, Kimball. Yeah. Hey, what's your favorite thing about hiking? Bubbly, beautiful views. Beautiful views? Peyton, favorite thing about hiking? Um, having fun with your family while hiking. Aww. Yep, me too.